pin surfs here and a preview or review of uh, one of the pinball games that I have in the man cave. And you've probably heard me talking about it on some of the other videos, but this is actually from Gottlieb from the early 90s, and it's called uh, Cue Ball Wizard. And it follows the same uh, lineage as the Bally games where we had uh, eight ball and eight ball deluxe. Uh, this video game has a likeness that uh, some people say is supposed to represent Clint Eastwood, but uh, they didn't quite uh, make his face just like Clint Eastwood's, but the voice certainly is. And when you hear him talking on this uh, video, when you hear him say, stop talking and start chalking, you'll know it's actually, or supposed to be, uh, Clint. And then sometimes in the video he'll say, make my day, and you know, crazy things like that, that we've all heard Clint Eastwood say before. But this is just a quick overlook of Bally's... Chalk up my man. Well, not Bally's, Gottlieb's uh, Cue Ball Wizard, with Clint in the background. So here's what she looks like. does have the dot matrix display from Gottlieb, has a pretty good sound system, has a lot of gadgets on the uh, play field, especially the full-size eight ball and the full-size cue ball, which that pinball just knocks around like it was uh, candy. Decent graphics. My first Gottlieb. And I think this is a System 3 Gottlieb. And surprisingly, some items are hard to find, like the decals on the drop targets. They don't make them anymore, so it's kind of hard to find some of them. A fun game. Lots of uh, lots of things that you've got to try to attempt. I've never made it all the way to pool ball mania yet, but uh, one round will be the horseshoe round, the no way round, spell double, where you've got to go from the corner pocket to the bank shots that are up there to the side pocket by hitting the cue ball, and the cue ball hits the higher targets right there. And it's got a little cue stick. But kind of a fun game, and uh, I enjoy playing it, and I just thought I would introduce you to it. Now what's interesting about this game is it has an actual size cue ball and an actual size eight ball as part of the play field, right here and here. And those are not props. Those are the real deal. I have the uh, old ones that actually came with this game, and I purchased new ones because they were a little worn, but uh, these are actual full-weighted cue ball and eight balls, and they are on the Gottlieb version. And believe it or not, the pinball actually moves those uh, balls. So let's see if I can uh, get one started. Quit talking and start chalking. And what happens is, it's an interactive. Your idea is, when the pinball passes an opto right up here, it will launch this eight ball, and the eight ball has to hit the blue targets. So let's see if we can get this down. See, pinball actually moves that ball with no problem. So you know how fast that thing must be flying.
Trail double round. on this machine is you have some interactive uh, elements to it where as after solving or hitting certain items on there you have three screens on the uh, game and you adjust by moving the flippers you choose which screen it's called find the king and somewhere behind one of those screens is Elvis Presley the king another screen could be a big piling or big pile of smelly cow manure and then there's a uh, moose there we go there's a moose or there's a uh, cactus so there's a lot of different choices so you can end up with that and then on the other uh, video screen that you can get uh, you use, move the flipper side to side, and you have an opportunity to catch falling cue balls. So, a lot of interactive stuff on this game for sure. You ain't thinking of leaving now, are you? Well, that's Gottlieb's Cue Ball Wizard. And uh, a word of caution though, with every pinball machine uh, that you have, if you're looking for an owner's manual, which I was for this off eBay, so you can get the schematics and you can get uh, instructions, uh, be careful what you order because it's kind of funny. Check this out. This manual off eBay for, uh, I think it was like 20 bucks. And as you see, everything looks good. You come to the back, unique parts information, Everything looks good, schematics, all in English. However, <laughs> this book is all in German. So it's not, <laughs> it's not exactly what I needed. Luckily the schematics are all fine, but uh, sometimes you can go on uh, international pinball database and you can download manuals, but Gottlieb is real picky. And they don't let you do that. Uh, they're not available for download. So uh, definitely be careful on uh, when you're ordering a manual for a Gottlieb game. All right, thanks very much for watching. And until next time, it's Ken Surf saying have a great night.